Hey there, it's 8 a.m. where I am, and what time is it where you are? It's time for This War of Mine. Season 2, because this is going to go better, I swear. Okay. Oh, that's right, we were raided. I'm wearing a shirt now, unlike the last episode. Amelia was slightly wounded, and we I think we just gave out our bandages for all of this shit, which is a good trade. We can always find more bandages somewhere. First, let's get everyone fed. You're wounded. Drugs aren't gonna help you. Maybe drinking will, but I kind of doubt that. What were we doing last time? That's right, we were stocking up in things. What do we have? We have a shovel, we have our crowbar, we have bullets for our non-existent guns, but I guess we can threaten them or sell them for money. Okay, let's make sure everyone's hot so we don't get sick. Oh, shit, alright. Let's go make some... Uh, you eat something first. One thing... Oh, no, no, you son of a... Yeah, not you. He's hungry. Our handy man is hungry. It might not actually make that much of a difference. You were rich. You are a lawyer. Which, depending on which side of the law you are on, you might be the oppressor of the masses. Yeah, well, you're gonna have to deal with that. At least you're not getting shot at. I think that's the first thing I'd miss about being in a war zone. Aside from, you know, missing not having bullets fly over me is the... So poorly, you're gonna sleep because you're tired. Okay. Mm yeah, I'm gonna miss hot food. I didn't really appreciate hot food until I, I was much older. Much like eggs, I didn't appreciate eggs as a meal until way later in life if part of you what is this yellow shit and why is it all goopy now i fucking love runny eggs hopefully we have enough firewood ah we're gonna need to get more wood is there anything we haven't opened up in our shelter here nope shelter's pretty cleaned up next on our priority list is to make ourselves self-sufficient we're gonna need more wood for this traps for small animals we have the component, uh, we have the parts, but we do not have the wood. Someone's at the door. Man, that's really demanding. Everyone's had their food. We're well defended. Let's put some fire in the... Fireplace? What is that? In the heater? While we see what we have to trade. If there's any complaint I have about this game, and. I tend to complain a lot with bandages. Okay. I don't have a lot, so we might just pass on this today. I don't like passing on it. I might be able to get some wood. Both for our fire needs and our traps. Alright, give me fire. Alright, now we can build our... First of all, we can put more fire here so we don't get sick. And now we can build our traps, which is the second stage of making ourselves self-sufficient. The first stage is protecting ourselves. Food is nice, but if you're dead, well, you can't eat it. Alright, this is a good start. This is actually what made it work that one time I won at this game. And apparently you can, quote-unquote, win in that you make it to the end. And they have even a, have a, uh, they have I can't into English. They have a nice set of epilogue slides, which implies that I missed a lot of stuff, but I'm not really sure. I'm not sure if you can meet their families or the things they talk about in their past, or if that's just meant to make you feel sadder about a already horrible situation. This is not guaranteed, but it doesn't hurt. Raw food. Crap food that we can't eat for. Oh, we can make a second one. And I knew this shit was broken the moment you could. I realized you could only build two. If they're limiting it, that means that you don't have to be anywhere. You don't have to go out. You can just keep playing safe. And I don't think that was the. I guess that is the option. There are people, I imagine, in the infinite 
f number of things that have happened in the history of the world that involves war, someone must have found a way to just stay at, stay the fuck out of the way of the guns. Don't stand in front of that end. Don't start none, won't be none. Next on our priority list, axes. One, because we can use them to chop this shit up for wood. They're a great weapon, because knives aren't really swords. Every man thinks they're a swordsman. You, you, the average man, I guarantee, will ask the, five out of ten. One out of every two men will. Home defense. Let's say home defense. We'll say that they're a swordsman, which is weird because spears are more phallic. But just, just that image of a knight. Which I don't know if that's still in the modern collective unconsciousness. Anyway, yeah, we're done trading. I'm not digging first. Can we up our next stage? Okay, let's focus. What do we need to do next? We boarded up our door windows. Improved metal workshop so we can get saw blades to access more areas. Hmm. A lot of components, a lot of wood. Let's see if that's. 16? Yes, yeah, 16 components, 10 wood, and more parts. You're sleeping in the day, Boris. I fucking love Boris. Him and his 15 slots. 17. I can't even read numbers. We do need bandages, but so we can, we'll keep an eye out for that. Still hungry, huh? Well... There's no uprising of violence, so I assume that we're safe to just sleep in bed. And we are pretty well defended. Quiet house. Lots of food, lots of meds. We don't want to get... In How can these people live normal lives? Am I in the shit part of the neighbor? Yeah, it's way across the war zone. But they're beside a burning building. I imagine that they should have more problems than me. Visited, visited. Not a fan of that. Lots of materials, lots of food. I don't want to fuck with those guys. Yeah, those guys are nice. They can we can trade for a lot with them. So the semi-detached house. We have some food. Hopefully the traps catch something. But what do we really need? We it doesn't have the parts or materials we need. So we might go back here. Materials and parts. We have a crowbar. I feel like I'm wasting my time with this move. Because I feel I don't remember if I actually cleaned the place out already. I think I've been up there. That's a good time to find out. That's a rat. I hope this doesn't suddenly become populated and I'm just walking to get my man Bars killed. What's his story? His foot was crushed under the rubble and he gets up. I'd be bitching. My fucking foot, guys! Holy shit! And, he's like, and he wants to survive. That's good for booze for Moonshine if we ever want to get into a trading game. But unless things go terribly south, which I'm pretty sure they won't, I don't think we'll need to. Okay, that's parts. We still need 16 components and 10 wood, which shouldn't be hard to either. Yeah, I have been here, but at least we're getting the materials we need to get to to get to our saw blades. Oh, okay, that's it. And six wood. Okay, sugar, you're gonna have to go. Do 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 do. Uh, honey, honey. That's a lot of stuff. Music, maybe. I might miss music. I'm still listening to most of the same stuff that I was listening to five years ago. Except I'm nowhere near as emotionally vulnerable. So I can't appreciate it as much, I want to say. Four, eight, twelve, sixteen, twenty. 12, 16, 20. That's good. Good run already. Boris, you're doing great work. You're doing God's work. No need. We have enough for upgrade. We don't have food. But this will at least buy us time for new areas to open up so we don't have to turn into murderers. R is a hard... Is it, is it a hard tongue thing or a soft tongue thing? But R, R, it's very hard for me. 
And if I try to roll my R's, I end up with an accent, which apparently is because the American English doesn't have rolled R's. Or at least it has them very rarely. Urgh. I don't know, you guys seem pretty satisfied with this warfing. Okay. He could do with some pills, okay? Marin is sick. He's our handyman. We need him to be okay. Still nothing on the traps, so that's bad. Someone's gonna have to go hungry, which is okay, I think. It's not gonna go south. Until people start complaining and you have to talk about them about eating. Baron, after you eat, you're going to... Fuck, bitch, get out of bed. Oh, you're wounded. I should have fed you. Uh, you're sick, so we're gonna get you some medicine. Some placebos. Those are the best medicines I hear. Okay. We do have one book. We need to make sure that our fire is lit. Make sure that we light their candles. That actually wasn't that good of a musical, but it was very entertaining. I think rent? Well, I guess most people missed the point. I thought most people, that, that sounds kind of arrogant of me to say, but... I saw something no one, you know, that I part of some sort of elite that saw something that wasn't. But friend, it was an exercise in irony. I don't, I can't justify that. I don't remember most of it, but it, that's the last thing I took from it. That's ironic. Most of this, they sing about one thing and do a completely different thing while wishing for that thing that they said they didn't want. Now that's a spoiler-free overview. Oh, huh. guns, eh? That I can go for guns. We need more materials. Oh, please don't be someone asking for help. I don't think we can give any right now. Because we don't want to? Uh, someone's gonna ask for help. I can't. Please, please be a new party member and be totally into that. Open. Yeah, I am here. What do you want? Jesus. <laughs> That's fucked. Uh, give me a sec. I don't want him to go. I don't want Boris to go. But because I think this is going well, and I like poking a bad thing, and I don't want them depressed and adding something else we can deal with, yeah, go, go. I haven't seen anything bad happen. How are your content? That's good. You will need that in the coming suffering. Okay, what do we want to build? We want to build an axe and we want to get more food because suddenly we're low on it. If we have to rob them, we will, but I hope it doesn't come to bad. Gun parts, weapon parts, and wood. You need to get out. And you need to sleep. Sorry. Okay, we need food and medicine. Yeah, go chop that wood. I don't even know what you bring to the party. Maybe you're a good trader? A tante lawyer? Because I haven't seen a point where I can actually argue with the psychopaths I run into. We have no wood. And I'm not gonna go full historian and burn some books. Oh, that's not good. People are gonna. People are gonna get sick. Hmm. You can sometimes hear shots fired from there. At the very least, he's strong. So that should work out somehow. Alright, let's do this. We need to find food and medicine. We can build our axe later. Let's secure it. We go back. Maslow's. We go backwards. What do we have available and what do we need? Oh, I remember this. If it hasn't changed too much, only one person has a gun. And the rest will weep uncontrollably at the sight of their dead body. 
But let's not start fights unless we have to. We're not that bad off. They can just get hungrier. It's an acceptable... Well, it's not a loss, but it, it's an acceptable outcome. Because I might win, but I might also lose Boris, who is the man. I want a saw blade. Okay, let's try sneaking up here. I don't know if that works out. Can they see me? I see light sources. I don't think so. They haven't reacted. They'd certainly react to a giant, presumably Russian man. Trying to sneak up their house. Ah, if I remember right, the food is here in this area. Or in the other area. This is going to need a saw, isn't it? I hope. Is anyone here? The problem with Boris is because he's strong but slow. Did anybody hear that? Is that because he's strong but slow? I don't. If once he's engaged, I don't think he can run. What's new in her bio? Where well, she really was scared. Can you do that quietly, Boris? Oh, close that door. I hope that door is closed. Medicine, medicine, medicine. Mine. Oh, it's medicine. That's not bandages. Oh, into the, into the darkness. We seek the darkness. Looking pretty close. I'm pretty sure they can't see you if you're in there. But they did hear shit. Uh, I missed the good old times too. Door is closed. There's a person up there. How's her backpack? Not full. Not worth yet to leave. Hmm. Thank you for informing me of where the medicine is. Okay, that was a little risky. Whoops! I am nobody! You know... That's gonna happen. Holy shit! I didn't know you could backstab that efficiently, but, you know... You know, going in a pacifist run might be super difficult, I imagine. A gun! Now we have power. Ah, uh, there's the, there's that sense of self-importance that can only be handed to you by giving you the ability to kill your fellow man. Food, that's fantastic. I guess you guys are gonna starve. I want to feel in this game, I really do. And I felt slightly bad the last time I did this, but I guess that's what desensitization. That's a hard word to say. Desensitized. That's what that does to you. Oh, bye, sugar. Valuables and booze. Don't need that. Get some alcohol. Make sure we get some bandages for art. If constant sobbing actually is kind of. The sobbing actually is kind of. I like finding funny in a dark place, but that's pretty dark. Hello. Goodbye. We're doing all right. How are you? Oh, thank God I got the gun out of the corpse. Because they get bad. But yeah, I mean... This is not something after the second or third playthrough that will leave you with a lingering sense of wrongness inside you. That might That may speak more of me than of the game itself. I never really had to make a bad choice here. Maybe I'm just overly practical and that's not good. Bullet. 
I have yet to meet someone who can outsmart Bullet. And if I try to roll my R, sometimes it comes out as an L. Which isn't good for communication or the thing that I'm doing right now. Uh, that's a really weird interpretation of the word run. But it's nice to know that if we hide in there, we can just backstab people. I think we're gonna use that later on. Maybe in a Rambo run. But I don't think we're gonna get desperate enough in this run. You really have to have intent, I think, in this game to do wrong. And right now, we don't have the... Alright, depression, that's a thing. Are you a smoker? Please be a smoker, because if you're a smoker, we've got just what you need. You're wounded again. What's important is we have food and... Bandages. That's right. Maybe the lawyer. Maybe we'll send the lawyer to cheer them up. That seems reasonable. Oh, you're a good man, Marin. We can manage without hurting others. Maybe. First you're gonna eat. No soup for you, Ivar. You're gonna eat, then you're gonna have a little heart-to-heart -heart with Boris, the man. We're still gonna use fertilizer to get more food. I'm not actually sure if different kinds of food will result in faster returns. But we do need to burn some shit for fire. Hmm. I may have overlooked something important. You. Jesus, talk to him. Marin's tired. Oddly enough, we need basic necessities such as components, weapons parts, and wood. Wait, we might not. I got a lot of weapons parts from that last run. Maybe it'll work out. Well, we can build a saw. No axe yet. We can build a saw. And we will build a saw. It's a one-use item, which is very unfortunate. Who builds- Oh, right, we're just cobbling this shit together. I can't criticize. Put me in, apo in an apocalypse situation, and I'm not sure I can do shit in it. We need to make fire. Do you have a lighter? <laughs> and even with a lighter, you probably won't succeed, because... If I, if I remember Bear Grylls correctly, it's a whole thing. It's not just set something on fire and hope for the best. You gotta protect it, you gotta nurse it. What's this? Yeah, we're done talking. Slightly sick, so let's get you some medicine. Oh, it's a chair. Our reservoir staying here is better. Oddly enough, we need materials. Materials and bandages for Spider-Man. I need you to finish sleeping. We need wood. Shit. You are start, gonna start getting sick. The good news is we have a solution for that. But I don't like having to find solutions for problems that shouldn't be there in the first place. Not that I'm questioning the good luck we've had in this run so far. It's been very good luck. We have sources of food. We're now self-sufficient. You want to talk more? No. Reality is cruel. If we have to survive, we have to be equally cruel. That's barely a thought. Those are two sentences said one after the other. Which is funny because she's a lawyer and should probably know about logical fallacies. But I guess it's not about what you prove, it's about what you can believe or make people, other people believe. I don't want you, want you to go out tired, sir. You're gonna sleep. And then we're gonna end the day. Zero degrees? Holy shit!
Yeah, I think that's gonna be it. You're gonna sleep, you're gonna sleep. We're gonna get a lot of wood. Very basic shit. It won't hurt them if they don't know I'm robbing them. They just think that, hey, your food's gone. Right? That, that's how that shit works in my head to justify what I'm doing. Which is weird because I don't... I don't feel anything in that. I don't feel like, oh, no, I'm hurting something, someone real and I should go to a priest and confess and bend over if I were a ten-year-old boy. But I don't. I don't feel that. I just... But I do recognize that their emotions... The emotions of the characters do matter. That a depressed character is more likely to do stupid shit or be tired like so. We should make a new bed. Uh, that's alright, but let's see what we got in here. <laughs> I recognize that, but it's more of a mechanical sense rather than an emotional connection with anything that's actually happening in the game. Again, that might speak more of me than of anything else. Uh, sure. I assume that door is closed. Oh look, a stabby hole. What do you got here? Okay, I was gonna say, if it's fucking wood, I'm gonna not flip my lid, but be really confused. Uh, why would wood and stuff be in there? It's a fucking file cabinet. I wonder if that shit can fall on me. Books, we need more wood. Let's push our luck. I want to know what's in here and see if we should go back. Good to know that there's a lot of stuff here at least. We can go back for that. Maybe there's food here. Priority is food. And after a certain point, there's no real risk to the game. And like say, Darkest Dungeons, which I've started on, and you bet your sweet bippy it's gonna be on this channel. Where there's always a risk. Do one thing wrong. You're always struggling. I know this is a huge contrast to how it was in the last run, but one run's enough to get a good understanding of how this works. And then that's it. There's nothing more. Which depending on you might be okay. It might be not. But whatever it is or not, that'll be the end of this episode, because I'm hungry and it's time for breakfast. Was I brewing coffee? Shit, I think I forgot my coffee. But anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, had a, a little chuckle, or if you learned something new, such as don't take things for granted because we've been raided, is someone hurt? Okay. At least it was the lawyer? Uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, like and subscribe if you, yeah, had a little chuckle or just learned anything. This has been Patinator. And we'll be back with more this war of mine.